morning, Pompano fans. I'm on another Pompano mission this morning. Still big. Should be good though. All right, it's dead high tide right now. Doesn't take much to get it out, dead high tide. You just want it right there in that slough. Somewhere right in there. It's sunrise, usually you get a big one right by the shore. Any second now, one of those poles should light up. Caught that pompano yesterday in the backwaters with a shrimp head on this one. So let me see if I can get a pompano in the surf. It should be really close to the shore right now. So I've got all three poles out. Now I'm just gonna flip this in the surf right here. Pretty much it's deep enough, 20 feet out. This north swell definitely cooled the ocean off. My legs are getting frozen real quick.
how to hit on this one. Got off. Oh yeah, here we go. Pompano. Woo! Oh, it's a big one. Oh, I just saw them jump out there. When they jump in the surf, that's when you know they're big. Oh my gosh, it's a beast. I only, I must have, there might be two on here. Oh my gosh, I don't want to lose them. It's a big one. I think this is my record. Woo! Woo! Yes! Oh my gosh, look at the size of this beast! <laughs> that is definitely my record. I was just thinking I'm thinking I'm gonna go fish in the backwaters like last night. Cause I wasn't catching anything out here. And look at this. <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh. You are a beauty. Woo. Oh, Pompano, Pompano, how I love you so. Silver. Oh, yes. Let's get it out there and get another one. Oh, it's a beauty. Look at this guy, compared to my foot. He's gotta be at least 17, 18 inches. We'll measure him when we get home. Surfing's the cure. Really hoping as the tide goes out, it starts picking up and we start pulling in some pompano. Trying to decide if I should go to the backwaters on the jet ski right now and see if I can get more pompano there or stick it out here. It's good. Oh, there. <laughs> now, do I touch this? No, it's going already. Oh, okay. Woo, thank you. Oh, you're very welcome. All right. <laughs> Had a solid hit on this one again. Not sure if it's gonna come back and take it. Hopefully. Alex is back on another episode. How you doing? Doing pretty good. Ready to get some more pompano? I guess so. All right, let's do this. Have you gotten so, any recently though? Not recently. I'm thinking about packing up and going on the jet ski to the backwater hole again because, I don't know, last time I said that though, I got the huge one. I was like, all right, I'm gonna pack up and go and then I got the big one. Yeah, so, your foot wasn't fully at the back of it, so that, that was double your foot. And oh, I know, right? So he had to be at least 20 inches. Maybe it might be a record, but I know the record's nine pounds, so I don't know. We'll see. Don't ever pull it and leave slack. 
When you're reeling in a surf rod, you gotta keep it real steady. You don't wanna pump it like this, because if you pump it, it leaves a little bit of slack, the fish gets off right away. Ah. So as soon as you feel a fish, you gotta keep this tip straight up like this and always keep it tight tension. So if you're walking towards the fish, you can walk towards the fish, but don't let it get slack. Slow down, keep it tight, steady, walk steadily. There you go, there you go. So then walk, yeah. yeah. That's all right, walk down to it a little bit so it doesn't pull too much on the weight. All right, there you go. Now set it in a pole holder and we'll get some new fleas for that one. I'm gonna get this one back out there. Nice, that was a solid hit. Slow down a little bit. All right. Bird swooping, there's a bird swooping. Is it a big one? Keep tension, don't leave slack. Keep the tip up. There a you bird go. Swoop. All right, keep, keep, hey, well, slow down, slow down, slow down. He's pulling drag, it's a big one. All right, that's a nice pompano. Woo! How does it feel? Pretty good. All right, keep it steady, keep that tip steady. There you go. Doing great. If it's a big one, you see him jump out of the water, usually out here. I'll come out here and try to film him. Don't pump it like that, remember? You gotta yeah, just keep sorry. it steady. Keep it steady all the way, and then once you get it close, walk down this way. Oh, it's a beast. Walk down, keep, keep going. Now drag him back all the way, drag him. No, don't, don't jerk it, just drag it. Go, drag, drag. All the way, all the way to the cooler. Go, run, run, run. Woo! Yes. Nice one. All right, cool, that's good. He's a keeper. He's a keeper. Is he really? Yep. He's got a nice pretty one as well. Pretty color. All right, nice, Alex. Good job. Yep. Check it out. Woo. Pretty decent size. Yeah. Smaller than the last one, but we'll eat him. So. Nice. All right, so we're gonna take it to the backwaters on the Fish Pro now because it's slowed down out here. And I'm pretty sure we're gonna score if we go back to that backwater hole. So here we go. Woo. All right, get this camera right inside here. Uh -huh. To the fork of the tail, it's 16. So you see the zero? Zero to 16 to the fork of the tail, 16 and a quarter. To the tips of the tail, he's 19. All right, so this is our catch today. Woo! We're gonna go take it to the backwaters and see what we can do now. Continuing with the 360 camera right now, and Alex just told me one of the funniest things I've ever heard somebody say, besides maybe my son when he was younger, because kids say the funniest things. But tell me what you just said. I thought he, he said we were gonna get Cuban sandwiches, and I thought he said human sandwiches. <laughs> I was panicking. Oh my gosh. I was freaking out. That is hilarious. So I'm taking Alex to Millie's Cafe for lunch real quick, and then we're gonna hit the jet ski and see if we can get some pompano in the flats. Wish us luck. Woo! All right. Welcome back. Uh, so, do I turn her on? So uh, we are about to go out. I
low tide, but we're almost there. Right, we're coming in, it's not super shallow right now. The Pompano are here, we can feel it. Sentimental energy. They're, they're life force yeah. within the waves. Golden color in the water indicates the Pompano. Okay, so once again, we're using a Pompano rig in the backwater hole. Let's see how this works. Yesterday, as soon as I cast it right over that little sand ridge over there, I got one on. They're right back in the same place. Let's see what happens. Sure, a two triangle weight will be enough. Man, it'd be crazy if I got two, two big pompano on these rigs. Oh, here we go. Oh my gosh, something big. Oh yeah, watch your line. It's going right over top of mine. Here, come over here. Reel your line up, tight. All right, this is a beast. Something on here. You can keep, you can keep fishing, just, let me just see what this is here. I haven't felt many head shakes yet. It could be a redfish or a flounder. Dang, we forgot the net again. Oh my gosh. All right, so uh, my man over here already got something. I've been casting off land and uh, he's been casting in a jet ski and he got something. He hasn't felt head, uh, head shakes yet, so it may be a flounder, redfish, we don't know. Redfish? I think either red or flounder. Red or flounder, yeah. Oh my gosh, it could be a huge pompano. It's just not fighting that hard. Oh my gosh, it's a huge sheephead. What? I've never caught a sheephead this big before. Really? Oh, okay, okay. Look at him. Snapping in the water just to get a closer look at this thing. Well, that's what you get when you use live sand, please. Look at that. Oh my God. Let's up. Oh, Jesus. That is a biggie. He's a beast. What do you have to say? Awesome. Woo. Oh my gosh. We were just talking about those. Yeah, I think it's black trim. Really? Wow. Is he really? Is it a black drum? Yep, that's a black drum. Is there any drum? Yeah, Where? Let's see how big it has to be. Black drum has to be 14 to 24. Easily. 17 and a half. Jeez. Nice. That is a great catch. A black drum. Woo. Yeah, let's see it. Let's see it. Yeah, you got it. Wow. That's a nice fish. Woo. Go on? I think so. Oh. Oh, you had a fish. Yeah, it turned into a stick. What? Yeah. There you go. You don't have to reel if there's drag going out. Don't reel. Let him fight and then reel. It's a nice pump now. You sure? Stop, stop reeling. Stop reeling. It's just taking drag. It's not doing anything. There you go. Wait a second. No. There you go. Now reel. Oh, yeah. He's a big one. Tighten it just a little bit, the drag. There you go. There you go. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, that's a nice one. Oh, that's a nice pompano. I can see him right there. Yeah, here, let's flip him over this way. Bring him over here. Yeah. Close. Got it wrapped around here. Here. Right. Woo. Yes. We got him. All right, nice pumping up. Woo! Yeah. 
Another ocean gold in the backwaters. Hold on. Okay. My man's over here, captain of the sea dew, caught another one. Oh, he's small. Back to back. Oh, it's a small sheephead. little sheephead? Yeah. Yeah. Sheephead. Disgusting. <laughs> we'll let him go. Yeah. There's nothing disgusting about them. Yeah. I want to let this bad boy go because, you know, it's too small. Too small. Yeah. Sheephead are just ugly fish in my opinion. They're beautiful. Well, look at the color. Have you ever seen the blue inside here? No, it's not about the color, it's about their teeth. Nice little sheep head. Almost got me. So, yeah, we got something on. Feels nice. Feels like another pompano, maybe. Smaller sheep head. Another sheep head. That's. That might be a keeper. Is that a sheep head? Guy over here just got another one. Oh, dang, that's a bummer. Never mind, guys. Well, no, it was oh, something. Broke the hook. Right. Broke the hook. It did break the hook. <laughs> that's never happened. How before. does that feel? Not very good. <laughs> Check this out. This is today's catch. This is the one we just got in the river. He's almost as big as the one we got this morning. I got this morning in the surf. Those are both a nice black drum too. A lot of meat on there. Keeper sheep head and another keeper pompano. Thanks again for watching everybody. Please click like and subscribe below and we'll see you on the next adventure. Thanks for your continued support. Please click like and subscribe below.